NASA, using radar scanning devices, has mapped the tectonic heights and depths of Mars' surface. By assigning colors to the various heights, a clearer picture emerges. Lower land is blue, then up to green, then yellow, orange, then red, and magenta. Finally, a pinkish gray. Here, yes. I don't know about you, but I think this is fantastic. It's the Grateful Dead version of Mars. By separating the levels with colors, we are almost invited to slide these layers of plates together. As you know, these indeed are plates, that is layers, like slate, like a cake, capable of being slid or moved apart and over each other when under strong pressure. If we move these layers back together, will the levels be assembled with each other? Let's slide these levels together and see. See if the colors reassemble on their levels. A warning, this couldn't happen unless Mars grew. Let's go forward in time. Now a comparison. The lower tectonic plate, the blue plate, begins back in time hidden only to be revealed as a new lower plate. With, as you can see, no new craters. Am I tricking you? and finagling with this map? Nope. You can see it clearly. You can see what we're doing frame by frame. Let's do <laughs> the whole planet next. 